Are we love? So I gotta find something for Lisa now. She, she'll be mad at me if I don't buy her a souvenir or something. Hey guys, so I am at the airport. Uh, I'm on my way to London. dinner. Um, we're actually celebrating Christmas a little bit early with my mom's side of the family um, just because everyone's always so busy. So today um, I am making cheesy chive biscuits and um, chocolate walnut brownies. I think they're going to be really good. Um, they look really good on the YouTube videos that I watch so I'm not the best baker but hopefully it all turns out good and everybody likes them. So I made it to London and I am feeling the jet lag so bad right now. Alright, just dropped Ruby in at my parents' house and now we're all going to um, my aunt and uncle's for our family Christmas dinner. Hi. I'm gonna smile. Yeah. Our Heavenly Father, we humbly uh, come before you now. We thank you for this food. We thank you for the White House family and their extended families, Lord. We ask that you bless them and bless this time together now, we pray. We thank you for the manger and we thank you for this time together. We thank you, Lord, for giving us this food and bless it to our bodies in Christ's name. Amen. 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 Right. You got the prize! Yeah! We were waiting, you can't. It's like oh, that's okay. a random noodle? The Christmas noodle. Thank you. Are we gonna um, this is your favorite uncle. Beast and you should love me. Merry Christmas and a happy new year. I wish you health, wealth, and happiness. <laughs> oh. Don't forget to pay your hey, rent. Nice Want to wish you a merry, happy Christmas and a happy new year. <laughs> merry Christmas. I'm nervous on camera. Hey I'm just really nervous. I don't know what to do with my hands. What do I do How about Merry hands? Christmas and Happy New Year? Oh, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Hi Lisa, love you. Fuck yeah! I'm in my messy hotel room here. I've only been here a day, and of course, my hotel room's already a disaster. Been doing some walking around London. Um, I've had a little bit of off time today. Um, I'm about to go to my first meeting. Tomorrow's the big day, tomorrow's the press conference. Um, but yeah, hopefully, you guys are enjoying the footage so far. Uh, London is amazing. Um, it sometimes reminds me of New York City, and it sometimes reminds me of Paris, which is really cool. It's the night before my big press conference and I'm pretty nervous. Um, I got to admit, I'm speaking in front of a significant amount of people and a lot of those people are pretty intimidating looking dudes and girls. Um, so yeah, hard time sleeping now, but uh, hopefully tomorrow we'll be okay. 
So here I am on the Thames River. Um, I just finished my press conference and my speech in front of about 100 people, many of them uh, ac really accomplished sailors. Um, it's nerve wracking. But the hard bit's over. We still got work to do. But the really hard bit's over, so now I'm looking forward to enjoying the rest of my trip. I'm having this melon for breakfast. I could really use the sugar rush because I'm exhausted. And I'm having this coffee. <laughs> oh, I miss coffee. <laughs> As you know, Kale is in London, England, being all posh and fancy. And I'm here in Canada, <laughs> missing him. Just sitting down for lunch, and um, I will show you what I have. I just feel like the past couple days I haven't been eating too healthy. Like, I feel like I'm eating way too many, like, car, well, like, wheat and, like, breads and stuff like that. I think it's because Kale's away, and uh, when he's away, I just tend to eat different. I don't know why, and, like, my sleep is off, so then I crave bad things in the morning because... I'm so tired and lazy, I just want something fast. I gotta get back on track, especially with my workouts. So yeah, I'll show you what I have for lunch. So I have three pieces of like sprouted toast. And on this one, I just have some avocado. And this one, I just have PB&J. I haven't really been vlogging a lot um, this week, especially because Kale's been gone. And I know he's taking a lot of footage and um, he's left me with the new camera, but I've just been so busy, like, so busy. And I try and have the camera glued to me like all the time, but it's really hard, especially when I'm chasing after like really little ones. Like I look after two, like anywhere from three and under. So you can imagine how busy that is. Ruby is always barking at something. Ruby, come. Want a greenie? Ooh. <laughs> Told you. She loves her treats. Ruby, up. Up. Hey guys, it's uh, my last full day in London and the work is completely done. All I've got is one meeting today, so I am finally able to take you to go do some exploring of this beautiful city. I've already seen a lot of it. I walked around for about an hour last night. Um, and let me just say, this city is incredible, but I wanna show you, not tell you. So I'm staying at a place called uh, Borough Market, and uh, it's really cool. It's like this, uh, Toronto's got a market like it. It's called the St. Lawrence Market, but this market is fantastic. It's an outdoor market. It's got all fresh foods, a lot of vegan stuff, a lot of cool just stands and shops. And literally, my hotel is my hotel is here behind me, and then the Borough Market is just down there. So I'm gonna show you. I bet you've never had fresh clementine juice. How many clementines are probably in here? Clementines are like the size of a plum probably took like I don't know 40 clementines to make this juice anyway it's good Oh, 
take one of those hop on hop off bus tours I think with the limited amount of time I have left I it's probably the best way for me to see the city I know it's cheesy and it's a bit expensive so not only did I make it on the bus but I'm here that's the tower bridge behind it. I feel like a lame tourist on this bus, but fuck it, it's fun. <laughs> so I'm in Victoria. I think I think the neighborhood's called Victoria, and it's like the transportation hub. It's got a huge, uh, huge subway station, I think, and there seems to be a lot of shops. So I got to find something for Lisa now. She she'll be mad at me if I don't buy her a souvenir or something, and it can't be a cheesy one either. Just in Walmart with my sister. Hey, girl, hey! hey girl. <laughs> Where am I right now? Uh, I'm not sure. Oh, I can't it's five o'clock in the freaking morning and I'm headed to the airport now. One more thing, I'm really excited to go home and see Lisa. Um, we were talking on the phone for a while last night or this morning, I don't even know anymore. And uh, yeah, I'm just excited to go home. Your head, promise you do 